The rectus abdominis muscle is a long, flat muscle. It is a paired muscle separated in the midline by the linea alba. Along its length, the muscle thickens and thins. You can see at the thinned parts of the muscle a tendinous intersection. And there are maybe up to four of these tendinous intersections. The origin of this muscle is on the pubic tubercle, the pubic crest, and the pubic symphysis. The muscle inserts on the costal cartilages of ribs number five to eight, and on the xiphoid process, which is about right over here. The action of this muscle includes compressing the abdominal contents, flexing the vertebral column, and tensing the abdominal wall. On the, this model, you can see the external oblique on this side of the model. It is not present on the opposite side. The external oblique is the most superficial of three flat muscles of the anterior lateral wall. The external oblique has an origin on the outer surfaces of the lower eight ribs and inserts on the lateral lip of the iliac crest and the aponeurosis, which extends all the way to the linea alba. This muscle compresses the abdominal contents. Both muscles together flexes the trunk, and each muscle by itself bends the trunk to the same side and turns the anterior part of the abdomen to the opposite side. Most of the fibers of the internal oblique pass in the superior medial direction. This muscle has an origin on the thoracolumbar fascia and the iliac crest over here and the lateral two-thirds of the inguinal ligament. It inserts on the, the inferior borders of the lower four ribs, the aponeurosis that ends at the linea alba, the pubic crest and pectineal line. This muscle compresses the abdominal contents. Both muscles together flexes the trunk, and each muscle by itself bends the trunk to the same side and turns the anterior part of the abdomen to the opposite side. The transversus abdominis muscle derives its name from the direction of the fibers, and you can see how they're crossing horizontally. The muscle has an origin on the thoracolumbar fascia, medial lip of the iliac crest, lateral one-third of the inguinal ligament, and costal cartilages of the lower six ribs. Uh, this muscle inserts on the aponeurosis that ends at the linea alba and the pubic crest and the pectineal line. This muscle compresses the abdominal contents.